Glorilla is arrested. Glorilla, she will be bonding out and she will begin charged with two counts of DUI with possession of a firearm and unlawful use of possession of a firearm. She had the she had the pistol in the back seat instead of her having it in a lockbox. She should have had it somewhere more concealed to where it wasn't accessible for a person to just come and open her door or reach back there and grab it. Yo Gotti said that black youngster, he was just inside of her car in the black seat. We know that young Dolph wife was one of the ones who basically told them Glorilla just left the venue. She's driving down this street. I want everybody to know any karma that comes behind everything that happened with Yo Gotti, Black Youngster, Maurice Hill, Raven, Key Glock, whoever's involved in this, they need to get justice for Young Dolph. This shouldn't have never went down like this. Glorilla should have never put herself in this predicament. Glorilla was pulled over, and instead of her taking the sobriety test, Glorilla, she sat there, and all she wanted to do was basically just get out of the situation quickly. You can't do that. In most cases, they wouldn't have let her refuse the sobriety check. She refused, and this is what led her to getting arrested. Everyone knows that she's one of the main ones who basically was allegedly involved in what happened with Young Dolph. I want everybody to know that this is crazy. Hit the like button, subscribe to the channel. Let me know if you're a fan of Young Dolph. Let me know if you think that anyone is involved in Glorilla getting pulled over. I want everyone to pay close attention because MPD knows that Memphis is heating up. Everyone is doing what they have to do, but some people that make a careless mistakes, some people not putting priority over like the stuff that they just want to do or places that they just want to go. Some people don't know that the faults you make, it could jeopardize everything. But we know that Young Dolph was one of the main people who basically tried to keep them, he tried to keep them straight because he was rocking with Glorilla and he wanted her to sign the PRE. RP Young Dolph, I want everybody to know Young Dolph was one of the main persons who told Key Glock, we could get this money and we could stay out the way. All we got to do is stay away from, you feel me? He always said that and he always looked at Yo Gotti and Big Jook as if Big Jook, he basically, like they was playing this little role, like they was playing a grown man's, like they was playing a game in a grown man's world. I want everybody to hit the like button, subscribe to the channel. Yo Gotti should have made it to where she was either driving in a car where she was in the back seat, in the passenger seat, or in the car to where she wasn't driving while she drunk. We all know that when you leave a club, you leave anywhere and you impaired to the point where you can't drive, you know that it's going to be a problem because you're going to start swerving on the road. You're not going to be able to stay in your lane and you're going to hit every nerve in the middle, the little white little lines with the little bumps on it. You're going to hit every nerve as soon as you even get on the expressway or on the regular street. Yo, God, he should have basically, he should have paid more money for her to be safer. He know this is one of his biggest artists. She just dropped an album. Her mixtape's going crazy. She been doing stuff with everybody, including Nicki Minaj and a lot of other people. I want everybody to know, R.P. Young Dolph, regardless of what's going on, they put themselves out there like this. And from what MPD is stating, MPD feels that everybody who played a role in this, he feels that everybody who was in that car is liable and at fault because nobody could drive the car off. Only thing a person could do is basically get out the car and let them impound it. As soon as they impound the car, this is where old girl and them who was with her, her friends, old girl and them who be twerking in them videos, she was standing on the side looking crazy. Ain't no way of looking crazy when y'all should have had a designated driver. It shouldn't have been the to the point where you sitting there driving yourself and you know you just drunk all them shots of liquor and you know for a fact that 
everybody everybody saw you didn't eat nothing and i want everybody to know when you don't eat nothing you drink you be even drunker than you would would be if you would have had ate something so i want to let everybody know this could jeopardize them this could jeopardize her this could make it to where she ain't able to be able to perform the way she able to perform now because she got locked up that takes her away from everything she got family she feeding it's people who she taking care of who like people in her corner who she really care about and she's the provider for them i want everybody to know do y'all think that yo Gotti should basically go out there and he should he should make it to where the people who she providing for is taken care of well he should make sure that they take care of their business and that they basically put money on the phone for her so that once she do get out, she'll be good. I want y'all to really know this is crazy. It's sad that this had to happen, but this happened every day in the hood. Memphis, everybody know for a fact is, look, when you go down the street, you can't even stop at a gas station without you seeing something or you hearing somebody getting hit up or something. Everybody know that Makita's set up Young Dolph. Glorilla was one of the main ones entwined in the mix of it because if she would have never been on Young Dolph's side and then instantly, as soon as Young Dolph passed away, she go and sign the Yo Gotti name, she wouldn't be in this situation because Young Dolph, he would have made sure she had a car, he would have made sure she had a driver, and he would have made sure that she had everything that she needed. I want y'all to really pay close attention Hit the like button, subscribe to the channel. Let me know if you feel that Glorilla messed up and she put herself in a messed up predicament to the point where now she has to literally, like, she got to do this little time for that. She going to instantly get right out, though. I want y'all to know this is a revolving door and we have to really open our eyes to the facts of what's going on. We have to really pay close attention because they hid a lot of stuff for a long time, but Young Dolph... He not the type of person who needs to be done like that. They tried to drag his name through the mud. R.P. Young Dolph. Everybody who knows Young Dolph know that Young Dolph helped more people than he even took from people. He didn't even want to take nothing for these people. He just wanted to basically put them on, put them into position, and make sure that they straight regardless of what's going on. I want everybody to tune in, hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, share this video. They shouldn't have never set up Young Dolph. Everything was a liability. Everything became some whole other stuff as soon as they did that to Young Dolph. R.P. Young Dolph. Regardless of what happened to Big Juke, they shouldn't have never put themselves out there like that. And now it's coming back on all of them. And regardless of what happened to them, this is a revolving door. We got to open our eyes to the fact of what's really going on. Real talk.